I told you. Once again, this is bullshit. And the whole nation is flim flam. I told you the boy was down in the well with the other boy. With the damn walkie talkies. It costs a lot of money to do this little bullshit. Somebody should have to pay for this. This costs money. Money is money. The kid was in a box, like they're saying on the news. Wolf Blitzer, bullshit, sir. I also think this is a cover up. This was a perfect distraction today. The president is in California right now. And uh, when you look at today in American society, some people launch off some experimental shit from an Air Force base or a base off the base. Kid missing. Oh, he's fine. We were contemplating on if they were going to find a body, and I was like, you know, will the autopsy prove if it was cold before it hit the ground or whatever? But no, he hid in in the barn or in the farm or in the barn, if on top of the barn, you think you go get in trouble? They saw something fall off the train. It's okay. We have just had a four hour distraction. There's no more Michael Jackson to distract us. There's no more Iran Contra. People do not give a fuck about Iraq no more. Afghanistan does not count. So what do we have still? left over the faith in some poor little kid being in harm's way to distract America a friend of mine says what would the distraction be for I'm like this thing looked like a fucking UFO man the distraction is for people seeing something that looks like UFO flying over Presidents on this side of the world, logistics, land here, have a little summit there. This is the excuse why there's a summit, blah, 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 yakety, blah, blah. The world itself is a conspiracy theory. I may be wrong, I may be right, but isn't it odd? Some little kid gets stuck up in some helium balloon that we've seen on TV for two hours straight and all of a sudden there was a basket on it and now for the next hour and a half there was a basket on it and then oh something fell off the basket oh he's hiding in the house so now they have Democrats aim at health insurance costs and this guy screaming blah 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 we've just watched a hoax perpetrated upon all of America and now we're watching some guy saying yeah Democrats health care blah 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 now that there's a Republican saying that we should have a public option we should have a public option but when as Americans will we be tired of the proverbial wool being pulled over our eyes those who saw strange lights over Denver saw weird flying things in Denver. I want you to comment on this video. We're being told to see what we're supposed to see. We're being fed to see what we should be seeing or not should be seeing or whatever. Everything is media driven. If you can show the cornea what the brain will believe, seeing is believing. Don't believe what you see. 
The whole world has been told today some little kid has been trapped in some experimental balloon and all we all waited for, all that we all waited for was for this thing to crash into the ground and rumors were they can't send a helicopter up because the turbo blades have pushed the air down and blah 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 yakety blah blah. They're going to try to snag it with a jet and drag it and slowly drop it down to where the helicopter can grab it. All these plots and plans they figured out within minutes was all shot to the ground. Oh, he was in a basket. The basket's gone. I'm doing my show, god damn it, you motherfuckers. I'm on the air live talking about this hoax perpetrated upon the American people, man. So listen. You believe what you believe. To show somebody's friend on TV. I think he's... There's a basket on it. No, there wasn't a basket on it. The distraction is complete and it has happened. Can we please focus on what the world needs instead of what they feed us? We as a people deserve the truth regardless of how painful the truth may be. We as a people, black, white, green, blue, purple, whatever color you are, deserve the truth from the United States government, the Vatican, Muslims, whatever the fuck you are, isms. We deserve the truth. We cannot no longer walk through life with blinders on, thinking life is one way, and all stop and pause to watch someone die. In a balloon, in a car chase, in a police shootout, in the rain, in traffic. You cannot watch idly by and accept the fleecing the infiltration of the human mind. The whole soul of America was captured today and locked into one chasm believing some little kid is running around inside some balloon to become, no, there's a basket. To know the basket fell off. To know he's at home. You can fool some of the people some of the time, but you cannot fool all of the people all of the time. Lie on a bigger stage like when you do when you create war. Let's not play the small in the mighty. You may place one man in position to guide it all, but he's but a shadow of those that guide us all. But to lie to us and believe we are stupid is to think we are all dumb. The situation came up and ended too quickly, too clean, too fantastical to be true with no faces to be seen, no names to be known, but a kid on a wayward flight named Falcon. Please. The next distraction in America should come with blood and mayhem because the world sees us do that to them for we shall feel their pain. But please let us do it at a rate better than foolery, trickery, and straight on parlor tricks. America, today, we have been tubed by Falcon, the United States government. Good night.